What are you doing out here? Watching the road for creatures and probably providing a free meal for any hungry beasties that come wandering by. Why don't you just run for it? Once you've listened to those noises in the shadows, you'll be glad of a secure place to sleep. It's no fun in there, but it's no fun out here either. Even if I did make it back to Harbour Town, the Inquisition would just bring me right back here again. Not many places to hide on an island. I don't really have a lot of options. I've dealt with your monsters. You have nothing to fear from the shadows anymore. Really? Those horrible things? You faced them? Yeah. They were... gnomes. Gnomes? Are you sure? They, they sounded a lot bigger. Well, there were a few of them. Listen, don't tell anyone about this. The boys will never let me hear the end of it. It'll be gnome heads in my bed for weeks. Sure. I won't say a thing. Thanks. You're a pal. God, will you look at the size of that thing? What? Where? I don't see anything. Have you overdone the smokes? Ah, another willing recruit to go into the Inquisition's service. I'm here to speak to the Inquisitor. Of course you are. And why should Inquisitor Mendoza, the leader of the Order of the Holy Flame, want to talk to a nobody like you? I have a message from Don Esteban. That's what you say. Maybe you're here to kill the Inquisitor. Do you really think a nobody like me could kill the Inquisitor. I think a nobody like you could be stupid enough to try. You'd better be from the Don, or the Inquisitor will introduce you to the Holy Flame. And I mean, introduce you to it really close up. Another recruit. The guards brought you here because you transgressed the law. Am I correct? No. I have a message from Don Esteban. Then I shall take it to the Inquisitor. I must talk to him myself. I see. During your time here, you may move freely around the monastery. This is a privilege. Please do not abuse it. Inquisitor Mendoza is in the Holy Hall. Where is the Holy Hall? I shall provide a map. We don't want you getting lost, do we? When I wish to, how do I leave? You do not leave. At least not yet. You cannot keep me here. Take your message to Mendoza. That is why you entered here, is it not? Do that, then we shall discuss whether you may leave. There's something here about magic. That wasn't it. Damn. It worked. This text is about magic spells. Did I hear right? You want to talk to the Inquisitor? I have an important message for him. What's it like outside? Are all the monsters gone? No. It's crawling with them. Want to know what they do to people? No. Not really. Now I'm here, can I leave the monastery? Yes, from time to time. But believe me, you're safer in here. So how do I leave the monastery? Master Pallas opens the gate, but he'll only do that once Master Ignatius considers you worthy. Who is Master Ignatius? Look, I can understand all the questions. I had them too. But like Master Pallas told me, everything in good time. You'll learn about Master Ignatius soon enough. So just relax. Look around. And be safe in the knowledge that nothing's trying to eat you in here. That didn't do it. That wasn't it. Yes.
Hey, when you talk to the Inquisitor, ask when the free beer and dancing girls are coming. You really want me to ask the Inquisitor that? Come to think about it, he doesn't have much of a sense of humour. Better leave it. How do I get out of the monastery? <laughs> That's exactly what I asked when they forced me in here. But don't worry, someday they'll open the gate. Someday? Master Ignatius tells Pallas who can use the gate. But he's a pawn for the Inquisition like the rest of us. So, get comfortable. Have a look around at your own pace before you're packed off to the ruins. Ignatius? Taylor told me about him. Well, if you apply yourself to your studies, you'll soon find yourself in his presence. <laughs> Look, another recruit, right? Me too. Tucker, recruit of the Inquisition, what a joke. The same people who chain me up now expect me to fight for them. You don't think we should fight? Against who? For what? If they're pulling us in for service, then the shit has really hit the fan. What do you think is going on? I don't think even the Inquisitor knows that. But one thing is certain. We recruits will be the first ones to get thrown into the fight. Lower you. What are you doing? He is someone who needs the protection of a good weapon. What sort of weapons do you have? Injure things, kill things, cause damage to things, that sort of weapon. But nothing's free. But I'll trade if you can't pay with gold. What weapons have you got for trade? Not much. Take a look. Most use a staff around here. But if you've got something decent to trade, I won't say no. Can you get me any blanks for smithing? Do you see any round here? There's simply no demand for blades here in the monastery. I could make some but you'd have to bring me some more. Have you got any decent weapons? How about I take one of my weapons and beat you around the head with it? Then you can see how decent they are. Easy, Tiger. Let's trade. That didn't do it. It worked. Hey, got a smoke? You think if I did, I'd give one to you? I wouldn't give you the pox.
Does the Don know that you're up here? This isn't the place for you. You've chosen your path. Now stick to it. Did you come from the swamp? Then you must know my brother Beppo? Oh, yes. I know Beppo. Don't let him get to you. He's got a bad attitude. He's always been like that. Your mother, Tilda, has been asking for you. My mother? I hope she's all right. Yes. She's in Harbour Town. Good. That's where she should be. Thanks for letting me know. Holt, you aren't allowed in here. You must have to keep your concentration as a guard. That's for sure. People will try and pull all sorts of funny business if you don't keep an eye open. It's tough, but you won't find me letting my guard down. Hours of boredom, all to be ready for that one moment of excitement, eh? Holt! This is only for members of the Convocation. I was told I could walk around freely in here. Yeah, but that doesn't mean you can go snooping around everywhere. Some areas are off limits. The cemetery is one of them. So beat it. I want to enter the cemetery. Why should I let a bandit like you enter our cemetery? What about some Bruegelweed? Bruegelweed. All right, you have a deal. Get me two rolls of Bruegel and I'll let you pass. Here, two rolls of Bruegel. Great. The cemetery's all yours. Another grave. We all go back to the earth. A little more for me. In the old days, Berenger, a mage, taught the art of combat, the art of fighting with the staff. He once said to his student, I can show you the path, but you must walk it yourself.
I hope it doesn't rain. I've had enough rain. One of the Don's men comes to the Order of the Flame. I am Master Vitus. As long as you behave yourself properly, you're welcome among us. But if you cause trouble, do not think because we are religious men that we cannot look after ourselves. Trouble. Stay out of the chambers and restrain the urge to steal or to start fights. Yes? Do you have any... Brugelweed? Why would I have Brugelweed? You're from outside here. If you get your hands on any Brugelweed, I'll take some. There are always people looking for a little herbal relaxation from the outside world. Or any other items you can bring in. Show me what you've got. That didn't do it. Better start again. Yes.
I'll have to pick this, or find the key. worked. Well? How did you get in here? Big hole in the wall. They call it a door. You're not a recruit. Neither are you by the look of it. I am the cook. So, if you want to get fed, mind your manners. What's on the menu, cook? Your plate is staying empty. Come on. I'm hungry. Here, have an apple. If you want anything else, try talking to Casper. Hey, uh, found any gold? I lost some around here. Ha! Do you really think that'd still be here? Have you got any idea of the sort of people who pass by here? Yep. Looks like it's gone for good. I can't take much more of this. Nobody knows where they come from. I'm sure you have plenty to do. Show me what you've got. Halt. Stranger. I have a message for the Inquisitor, from Don Esteban. The Don, huh? That will get you in, but try stealing anything, or causing trouble, 
and I'll feed you to the pigs. A week clear. I'm not looking for trouble. There are those that find it without looking. Go on, pass. Which path did you choose? I'm going to be accepted in the order as a warrior. So, are you ready to serve the order? I'm ready. Always room to improve. Keep learning and I'll get even better. Still, when the time comes, I'll serve. Sounds like you're ready. Hey, got a smoke to spare? I don't touch that stuff. Rot's your brain, and the brain is all you have, whatever you do. Your body will fail you, but the brain won't. What is it you do here? I am in charge of the artifacts. I see everything our recruits bring out of the ruins. Everything. These are the key. The key to finding out why the ruins rose up from nowhere, to explaining the storms. It's important work. Any magical items must be brought here. They must be processed. And if I go, will you give me a magical item? No. Not even a little one? No. What's in those chests? Silver and gold, jewelry, junk. Nothing significant. Can I have some of the gold and silver junk? No, it belongs to the Order. There are those who value junk, and we may need to bend such superficial greed to our purpose. Yes, we couldn't have anyone's superficial greed being satisfied without authorization. Could we make a deal? A deal? Well, there are objects of minor value. Maybe you could buy an artifact or two. I suppose increasing our gold supplies would be beneficial. Let's trade. Stealing! Now. You'll pay for that! That didn't do it. Did it? Dawn and I'll a week. Oh yeah. We're clear. Word to the wise. Get cocky with the Inquisitor. They'll be picking up pieces of you for weeks. Get me? I got it the first time, when it was clear. Go and deliver your message. I'm going to be... So... I'm ready. Always room... Sounds like you're ready. Hey. I don't touch that stuff. Rot's your brain. What is... 
I am in ch- I see any- And if I- No. Not e- No. What's in- Silver. Nothing. Can I- No. There are- Yeah. Could we- A deal. Well, no. Maybe you- Let's- Interesting. Start again. Job well done. Better start again. Did it. Wasn't it? Oh no. Job well done. Better start again. That wasn't it. Did it? What is your business here? Just looking around. Curiosity is a virtue. But do not disturb the peaceful atmosphere of the monastery. I shall know if you do. Sounds fair enough. What can I learn here? Open the books and you will discover. That is why the books are here. Read each one of them. Knowledge must be sought. It does not just come to us. The rune table. The rune table is a powerful tool. Blah, 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 blah. Here's something. To prepare the rune table, place the desired rune in the table. There, that's it. Scroll preparation. The scroll maker prepares himself mentally, then places the ingredients, the blank roll of parchment, and the quill alongside the prepared rune table. Copy the rune, noting all strokes and details made by the rune maker. The rune table is the secret, then. You another recruit of the Inquisition? I'm guessing you're not a volunteer. A volunteer through press ganging, by order of the Inquisitor. What happened? Bad luck. I was out hunting wolves when a white robe patrol passed. Some of us got away. They caught me. You're a hunter? Yes, but nobody here cares that I can handle a bow. Here I'm just recruit Jervis. They want me to learn star fighting and magic. I'm hoping by the time I've learned the magic I have to study, the Inquisition won't need me at the ruins. Can you teach me about archery? I don't think the Masters would like me teaching you. What they don't know won't hurt them. I'm busy. I'm trying to understand these scrolls. Let me help you with them. It'd be enough if you got me a couple of things so I can move on. Just to keep the Masters off my back. Like what? A scroll of illusion, say, and two blank parchment rolls. And in return? I'll teach you what I know about archery, sneaking and hunting.
Don't touch anything. Show me what you've got. Show me what you've got. This is what you need. Thanks. Passing something once in a while stops them wondering why I'm slow on everything else. All right. Now I'll teach you something in return. Can you teach me about hunting? Well, what brings you here? I'm here to talk to the Inquisitor. I speak on behalf of Don Esteban. An envoy? I hope you'll come offering a hope of peace. I am only empowered to speak to the Inquisitor. Of course. You are free to enter the Hall of the Flame. Here to find out about the main gate. I need to know when it will be opened. I heard you're in charge of it. Plain speech is useful, but some may consider it rude. No matter. Master Palace will open the gate for you. Too risky. Stop there. No admittance. How are you doing with your studies? Some days I don't think I'm going to complete my studies. Not even if I manage to live to a hundred. Start again. It broke. Did it. This text is about magic spells. There. Better start again. That wasn't it. Damn. Yes. You trying to make me suspicious? Let's hope the storms stay away. You not got better things to do? Here, about scrolls and ingredients. Preparing a telekinesis scroll requires wing dust. That wasn't it. That didn't do it. Better start again. Did it. You're acting strangely. 
You do. Let's hope the storms stay away. Interesting. Hey. Greetings. What are you doing here? I'm looking for a book. Any book in particular? It's called Wisdom in Combat. The monastery is supposed to have a copy. You like reading? Yes, I read a lot. And write a lot. You write books? Books, no. Scrolls. I make sure the Order always has enough healing scrolls. I spend most of my time doing that, actually. In the writing chamber. Oh, and I also train and practice with the crossbow. The crossbow? We don't use them in warfare. But the truth is, I'm damn good at it. And I enjoy it. Are you good enough to train me? You don't hold back, do you? But yes, I can train you. Here, a copy of Wisdom in Combat. Hey, you got it. It was in the cemetery. What was it doing there? They're collecting lots of artifacts and ancient knowledge there. Even in times of turmoil, the Inquisition should respect books. A lot can be solved with books, but that's not your fault. I owe you a favor. What can you teach me? This text is about magic spells. Nothing new. Job well done. That didn't do it. It worked. What? <gasps> yes, time to go. Interesting. That wasn't it. Better start again. Damn. Did it. was an ant. Damn. It worked.
Interesting. That's impossible. Wasn't it? That didn't do it. Oh no. Did it? Ah, telekinesis. The power of thought can move matter, allowing a mage to move objects towards them from a great distance. Switches and levers which are far away can also be activated. That's something to know. spell produces a shell of energy that rolls around the mage casting it. The mage transforms, shrinking so they may enter small spaces. That could come in handy. something here about magic. <sighs> that wasn't it. Did it. The mage places himself in a floating state. He moves only with the power of his mind. As long as he concentrates, Heights can also be overcome. However, this requires more concentration. start again. Yes. There's something here about magic. Here, 
any mechanical lock can be opened by the will of the mage, regardless of how complicated they are. is about magic spells. There's something here about magic. This text is about magic spells. Magic barrier. There's something here about magic. This text is about magic spells. Interesting. something here about magic. This text is about magic spells. Better start again. Job well done. says, the illusion spell. Aha! The necessary component is the tusk of a boar. Have you brought me something to eat? Uh, put it with the other plates. If I have time, I'll eat it later. What are you doing down here? Research. So, don't touch anything. I've got it all perfectly organized. Do you have to do your work down here? Alchemy is dangerous. It's not something you do in a crowded street. You don't want people juggling your elbow or stealing your secrets. Besides, it's quiet down here. Most of the time. Can I learn alchemy? Ha! 
Young people, I want to learn centuries-old skills in an instant. It doesn't work like that. Alchemy must be respected. It demands time, concentration, and skill. So there's nothing you can show me? I didn't say that. I can show you a few principles, but don't think you'll be able to start research and experimentation straight away. May I buy potions from you? Yes, yes, I have an abundance of everything. Almost everything. Actually, my potion supply is very limited at the moment. I'm waiting for a new delivery of ingredients, you see. Let's trade. Can you teach me? Let's finish that. That's done.
That's finished that. This text is about magic spells. Interesting. This lock is too difficult. What does an outlaw want here? I bring a message from Don Esteban. Why does he not come himself? Why haven't you gone to him? Defiance. That is what I have come to expect from the Don. And all the Don gets is aggression, intolerance, and a deaf ear. Isn't it time we change that? But I will hear you. Tell me the Don's message. Simply this. The fighting has to stop. Is Esteban afraid or weary? The creatures from the temples don't care what side we're on. They attack everyone. They are the real threat. We should work together to solve our problems. These creatures are a distraction. They are not the real threat we face. If there is a worse threat, do you really want to face it while still fighting these creatures and the Don? You need fewer enemies. That can come with peace, or with their destruction. Conflict weakens your forces, as it does ours. So does having a cancer eating away at us. Peace with the Don has brought us nothing but trouble. Then we shall fight on. This threat will grow, your forces weaken, and we all lose. Now the Don realizes that. He sees the storms. He knows the mainland has fallen silent. 
Then tell me what we face so the Don can understand. Isn't that obvious? These storms, these temples, the very future of humanity is threatened. You need to tell me more about what's going on. The gods have left the world. Humanity was supposed to be free. Instead, these storms are sweeping us from the face of the land. These creatures are killing our people. But while the Holy Flame burns strong in this hall, we stand a chance. Let's see if your actions and words match. I will offer you a task. Carry that out, and I shall take it as a sign that the Don can be trusted, that your words are true. Why did the gods leave the world? A mage who wanted to free humanity drove them from this world, and we are at the mercy of what that magic released. What matters now is our survival. Why is the Holy Flame important? The Flame is a source of magic. The island is protected by its power. Protected? What about the ruins that appeared and the creatures? They are not our prime concern. It is the storms we must worry about. You keep talking of a worse threat. What is this threat you fear? The Dark Wave, the mage used to free us from the gods, has released other powers. Titans. Crossing the seas, they come with the storms. I have seen them. I have witnessed the destruction they bring to humanity. They are everywhere, and we have found no weapon that can stand against them. What are the Titans? Will you follow me and learn? But how can we stop this destruction? As long as the flame burns, this island is safe, and that gives us time. Time to discover why the Titans do not come here, how they may be stopped. Yes. Show me. Good. I have not misjudged you. Follow me and learn the truth. This world, all the lands you know, were once the domain of the Titans, old beings that shaped this world. They are raw forces of nature that were tamed by the deities you grew up knowing. The gods that enslaved humanity. It was man's duty to drive away those gods, to loose our chains, but in that action, the Titans have also been freed. They seek to take this world from humanity. Human, Titan, one must give. It will not be humanity. Follow me and we shall make certain of this. I have fought the Titans, on land and sea. But their magic is old, their bodies incorporeal. We will win this battle only once we know how to use the flame. But for that, we must fathom its mysteries. Come, we must go. The temple ruins contain many secrets. It was in such a temple I discovered the ocular I wear. It shows me the magical currents of the world. The holy flame has its origins in the fire of the volcano, and the currents on this island flow there. It must be tied to the secret of this island's survival. Come, let us go there.
Here, this gate will lead us to the source of the Holy Flame. This gate will lead us to the secret of the storms. Humanity must be defended, and it is the flame that holds the key to this. How do we get this gate open? No spell, no brute force can open it. Only the five keys it needs will do. Five crystal discs will open this mechanism. How do you know those discs will open this? I have one of them, and it fits the lock. Unfortunately, the one I have is damaged. The other four missing, but they must be on this island. I came here to seek answers. Those answers are inside this mountain, beyond this gate. You will get me inside. Find these discs. Find them and bring them to me. Is there a faster way to reach this place? Take this teleport stone. It is a valuable artifact from the temples. It will bring you directly back to me. This is your mission. This is your duty. Do not fail it. So if I help you, then Don Esteban will get the armistice he proposed. Peace. Gold. As long as he allows us to do this task, he may do as he likes. But you will bring me the crystal discs. You will open this gate and then enter the temple with me. Why? Because you serve Esteban, and that is my price. Find those discs. About the crystal discs. What happened to the damaged disc? It was exposed to the dark wave. The magic released to drive away the gods, and its crystal lost all of its power. Without it, we cannot open the portal. So what was the point in coming here? I think we can repair the missing disc. I sent the mage Cyrus to see to this. How can the disc be repaired? The druid Eldrick is an expert on crystals. He should be able to help us. And he has spent time studying the ruins here. If anyone on this island has the knowledge to repair the disc, it is him. You don't know if he can fix the disc? If you spend your life waiting until you know things for certain, you will learn nothing. I sent Cyrus to the druid, but he has yet to return. You should check on him and see what progress the druid has made. So you think something happened to Cyrus? We should investigate to make sure we must repair the disc. I will look for Cyrus. Good. See to it. Make sure Eldrick repairs the disc, then bring it to me. But hurry. We do not have much time left. Where do I find this druid Eldrick? He's a hermit. He has a hut on the east side of the island. It is at the foot of the volcano in the shadow of the mountain face. What do druids do? They study magic, draw on the raw, untamed power of nature. This can make them a little strange. They spend their time getting closer to nature, studying animals, avoiding order and civilization. And this druid has the knowledge to help us. Druids are guardians of very ancient and powerful knowledge. Knowledge we need now. Where else should I look for discs, besides the Don's camp? There are no discs in the monastery, but Severin is gathering artifacts at the Inquisition camp outside here, at a place called Tilda's Farm. We can hope he has something there. Talk to Severin. See what they have discovered. Now is not the time to talk. 